Okay, today we're starting on workbook page 34, and we're gonna be learning about unit rates and unit prices. So unit rates is when you're trying to find something out of one unit, and a unit price is when you're trying to find a price out of one unit. So let's start with number one. It says write each rate as a unit rate. So we have four points in four quarters. Sorry, 44 points in four quarters. So we're gonna set it up as a fraction. The first number always goes as the numerator. So 44 points in four quarters. So now we actually wanna divide it out to find how many points in one quarter. So that's what a unit is. So we do 44 divided by four, which gives us 11. So it's 11 points per quarter. And we usually use that word per to represent a unit rate. Number two, 125 feet in five seconds. So we wanna find how many feet per second, so in one second. So we have 125 over five. We're gonna divide that and we get 25 feet per second. Number three, 360 miles traveled on 12 gallons of gasoline. So we have 360 miles over 12 gallons. So 360 divided by 12 is 30. So we get 30 miles per gallon. Twelve meters in twenty eight seconds, so twelve meters in twenty eight seconds, so this one is a fraction it 's not an improper fraction like the rest of them have been it 's a fraction that 's less than one, so instead of dividing these because we 're just going to get a long decimal we 're actually just going to simplify it so these can both twelve and twenty eight can both be divided by four and we would get three over seven. So we get three sevenths meters per second. So that would be our unit rate for number four. Number five, Molly shot 20 baskets in four minutes. Nico shot 42 baskets in six minutes. How many more baskets did Nico shoot per minute? So let's find each person's unit rate. So Molly shot 20 baskets in four minutes, which is five baskets per minute. Nico shot 42 baskets in six minutes. So he shot seven baskets per minute. It says, how many more baskets did Nico shoot per minute? So we do seven baskets minus five baskets means two baskets more per minute. So whenever it says how many more, that usually means to do subtraction. For Carolina's birthday, her mom took her and four friends to a water park. Carolina's mom paid $40 for five student tickets. What was the price for one student ticket? So this one, we're finding the unit price. So this one is unit price because we're working with money. So $40 for five tickets is $8 per student ticket would be the unit price.